Hi, for any econometric analysis, the most important aspect we need to check is whether the data is stationary or not. If the data is not stationary, then the results we get will be absurd. So the first thing we have to do when we import any data series is to check whether the data is stationary. Now we go here in views and we will check using unit root test and we'll be using the augmented Dickey Fuller tests. The unit for root in level will be tested. We hit OK. We'll get the result. Now we find that the T statistics is 3.25 which is less than 3.44 you have to see the absolute value and you have to ignore the sign. Now we find that since the t statistics is less than the critical value at one person level, we have to accept the null hypothesis. And the null hypothesis states that US VIX, that is the US volatility index, has a unit root, which means this the US volatility index is not stationary. So obviously we cannot use this data in its present form. We will check whether the data is stationary when we use the first difference. We go here, we hit unit root test and we will select the first difference. We hit OK and now we get the test statistics as 15.89 which is greater than all the uh, test critical value. So you can reject the null hypothesis which is the first difference of US VIX has a unit root and conclude that the data is stationary. Now obviously we cannot use the uh, existing data so we have to modify the data formula gen r uh, sorry, it should be gen r gen r means generate the variable and we will give a variable name US Wix D. Of course, you can give whatever uh, variable name you want. That will be equal to. Now we want to find the first difference of US Wix. So we say D within brackets US Wix. Um, we don't want just the first difference of US Wix. Uh, we need the final data that is the US VIX minus the first difference of US VIX. So we subtract the first difference of US VIX from US VIX. So we have the final formula will be gen R US VIX D equals US VIX minus D US VIX. We hit enter and we see here that a new series is created you can open it and this series will be the modified first difference US VIX value which can be used for econometric analysis